fuck is up, my juggalo yo wheels? I have not recorded in, man, a month? Yeah, a little over a month, actually. Over, over a month. Christmas happened, you know, Christmas break, kind of stuff. Well, I don't have Christmas break. I don't have a school or job. But, you know, that period of time where all the holidays and, and all that's going on. I've been playing a lot of Final Fantasy 14. I just wanted to get through Stormblood again for the third goddamn time. <laughs> um, so, I know where we're at. I know we're at the Song of Nephilim. I know that's one of the hardest parts in the game with a big gap in uh, difficulty. Difficulty jump. I just ate a big... Uh, so I'm getting some indigestion over here. Big... Uh, Chipotle burrito because it's currently like zero degrees out and wind chill is like minus 30 so I said you know what? I'm gonna make some wagey bring me some food and I needed the spicy to try and clear my sinuses because my head is killing me my spine is killing me my neck is killing me my shoulder is killing me that's another reason I've been recording I have a lot of pain lately physical issues which some of you might might think is funny, but uh, it's not. It's not funny. <laughs> so the one thing I did do, uh, I leveled up a little bit. I did grind a little bit. I grind, I grind, I grinded, ground, I ground beef for about I'd say like forty five minutes, if if that long, maybe half an hour. Um. Originally, I was going to get. I was going to go look around for the these and build me a big old robot so we don't get stuck problem is I saved after we went to the Song of Nephilim and you can't leave um, but you're able to use the Encephalon in the UMN network you know this the 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 EVS I mean the environmental simulator so I was able to grind. Uh, I thought it was also looking for the keys and the doors, and then I got I got lost in the uh, Encephalon world again, just like I did when we first played through it. The one with the where it was like back in time on uh, not Midgar, um, Metroidvania. So uh, let's just continue like nothing ever happened. But yeah, I only played like thirty minutes doing that. I thought I was going to get all the robot parts and stuff, and just spend like two hours doing that. I had a guide open. It was going to be slow. It wasn't going to be worth recording, so I just didn't record it, and then I just ended up grinding for like 25, 45 minutes, getting lost and confused. But yeah, uh, and that, that also helped me remember how to play, kind of. So hopefully, I hope the audio levels are where they were before, because fuck if I know, man. Oh boy, um... Blow them all up. Let's just go straight to the top. All the way up. Nothing can stop me. I'm all the way up. Also, man, uh, this was supposed to be uploading, like, January 1st. Uh, it's currently the 13th, and I still haven't uploaded a single episode, or rendered or edited a single episode, because I still don't have any ideas for an opening. I might eventually, uh, throw some shit together anyway. i just be done with it. Okay, we'll leave it. Where are we going? Look at him dancing. You got the head bob. I know somebody's in there. I know you're in there, little lady. It's probably one of the ladies. We're gonna have to fight him. There's no way I'm getting around him again. I don't know how that happened that first time. Move your, move your, move your ass, dick lord. Oh shit. We're gonna fight. Okay, here we go. I'm also. All right, uh, Junior can do uh, an AOE now as well uh, with two attacks only. 
I was hoping to get that for Shion as well, but she just kept not getting it, so I gave up. As you can see, I completely forgot to use a Biosphere. More information on Dawn Trail. Well, not more. They, they showed the full trailer and all that. Finally. Oh, man, these guys are so fucking hard. They give so little experience, and they have so much HP, and they do so much damage. I mean, yes, I'm not dying. I'm saying that awkwardly, I guess. Oh, these guys are so difficult, and nothing's happened. But you know what I mean? Like, just Junior and Cosmos doing that in the land, in, in the Cephalon area wiped everything out. And they gave me, like, 500 experience for, for fight. Let's see how much we get for this fucking garbage. Look at Shion's fucking dying already, dude. I also switched her back to the G shot. Look him up, Chuck. And yeah, my head is killing me. My body's killing me. I don't know I don't feel good. So... My spectacular commentary might not be up to par. It's also cold. There's a way to start with boosts, but I don't know... I should look that up, too. Thank you, Cosmos. Clearly the seventh floor is wrong. We're going down anyway, we'll run back to the ship. Whoa! I guess she runs out. Chill. I'm not I'm not saying it looks bad at all. Like most of it looks pretty interesting and exciting. And some of it looks really cool. And some of the theories from people um if they're true will be pretty cool. It's kinda of fun not to know. I forgot what I was doing here. Don't use a save point, don't use a save point. Okay. No one breaks his finger. I also upgraded all the robots, fixed all the robots. Didn't change any weapons on them, just upgraded the uh, the armor on Xion's because I hadn't yet. Or no, upgraded the armor on Junior's because Xion and Chaos's, I got Chaos's by mistake that time, if you remember. And I also gave them better armor because I got a lot of money from that grinding, even though it wasn't very long. I still have 14,000 money left. I am going to have some uh, better computer parts by the time this is up, for sure, but uh, not while recording this. My brother is volunteering some pieces for me because of my birthday. Let's try this. So that'll be, that'll probably help this a lot. And, and recording in general. Are we correct, Mundo? Are we correct, Mundo? If you hear that, doo -doo -doo, that's my vent in the bathroom slamming open and closed from the fucking 40 mile an hour winds. Okay, don't go down the poop chute. What floor are we supposed to. Mm. Okay, here we are. What a shithole of a building to fucking be in.
Neo Armor A. Is that a gear for us to wear? To equip? Or is it for a robot? Did I see it anywhere there? Neo Armor A. Okay, who's that for? Who's Neo Armor A for? Um. Oh, okay. 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 <coughs> Which door should we go in? Let's go this one. Maybe we should win the other one. Okay. Okay, we can't go in this one. Oh boy, get inside. Um, the, the female animal girls are pretty fucking gross. Um, they also hired a, uh, <clears throat> for Elon Musk here so I don't get banned, and YouTube's a transgender individual to voice it. Um, so that's pretty gross too. Fitting though, uh, monstrosity. Having such a skilled voice actress, tr 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 actor. It was such a voice actor. Such a great voice actor. That was the wrong floor. It was the right floor, but there was. I had to push a button somewhere. I guess. I don't know what we're fucking doing. As far as the game's kind of gay. Um, I'm a little bit lazy in everything we already knew too. Like, just okay. We're googling. By Google, I mean DuckDuckGo through uh, <laughs> Leaper Wolf for Brave. Uh, <laughs> That's not gonna work. It's gonna bring up Bible stuff. Okay, no, it worked. Based. Yeah, yeah, I don't need the lore, you cocksuckers. Cocksuckers. Walk through. Song of Nephilim. Go fight. Oh, go fight Momo. The enemies are really powerful here. Don't use this place to grind. Is there a song? You find Momo. Alright, let me leave the. Let me go in the elevator and fall down. I'm gonna do this through my little OBS <laughs> so I can still read. Wait, wait, wait. What? There's a button. Okay. Okay, here's where the button is. Destroy six blocks. And in one of those fucking hallways. One, two, three, four, five, six. Okay. Okay. I wish you would just tell me what floor to go to. It's a terrible guide. What did I expect from IGN? Where's the fucking real guide? Where's the game fact? God, that music going ham. Oh, it's new music. Oh my god. Game fix. Stuck with the IGN walkthrough. Okay, okay, these fucking cocksuckers. One, three. 
four, five, six. Each block, as in one square, even if it's combined. You dumb cucks. What the fuck? Is... What floor are we going to? Two? Three? That's what I meant by two. I meant the second one. But, you know. Okay, where's this button supposed to be? There's a door in the left wall. There's a button you have to push. Decoder 14? Wait, do we have decoder 14? We have decoder 14. We do not need to go to decoder 14. But we do have to fight this stupid fucking robot. Aha! Uh -huh. We will on the way back, though. There is not a door on the left side. You fucking... Oh my god, that's the door. That's the door? Fuck Xenosaga forever. Push it close. Push it. Oh my neck. Oh my head. Oh my AIDS. Oh my AIDS. Other than, other than the furry girls looking, oof, uh, and the the voice actors, <laughs> um, it just also I don't know. It just kind of feels whatever. Like bigger problems. Here's the bigger problems about this that have come come out over time. They've replaced. I mean, rather they now this is how they worded themselves. They gave. Koji Fox, and they gave the lead writer promotions. Um, so they are no longer actually the lead writer or everything Koji Fox is the lead of, which is localization, lore, and singing for a lot of the songs. Now, of course, he's going to keep singing. He's going to keep overwatching. He's the supervisor for that now, for the lore and for the uh, localization. The actual localizer now is... I don't even know. It's not a... It's not trans. It's like... it's But it's a very liberal, you know, tatted up, dyke haircut, colored hair, the the feminist problematic glasses. Uh, you know, it's one of those. It's a San Franciscan, let's say. The San Francisco treat. And so that's worrisome. And then I'd say even more than that, because Koji Fox won't let them... I, I can't imagine he'll let them really fuck the game up oh, with the localization. Um, too badly. The bigger problem, I think, is the writing issue. The lead writer, uh, she got promoted to supervise all the writing, and instead they replaced her as the main writer of the story for Don Trail, at least, with a guy who is obsessed with 12, which is just a god-awful game, um, and who has written the only things he's contributed to the game in a big in a big way. Anyway, he's done little bits and parts, but his biggest contribution to 14 was the insanely long, very fucking boring, uninteresting garbage that was the Dalmasca raid stuff, the... the Final Fantasy XII raid stuff in Stormblood. So, writing, like, the story doesn't sound very uh, enticing at the moment. It's not that I'm not excited, though. I, I am excited to play. I'm very excited to, like, see this new... And then they revealed the map. <laughs> this is funny, and I like it. Um, you yeah, know, let's just go. Fuck it, whatever. Okay. Fifteen boxes. Fifteen boxes. Is that three or four? I don't know. One, two, three, four. Five, six. 
7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13. I already forgot how many boxes this was kill. I forgot everything. I don't know. I don't know what I'm doing anymore. Um. May I completely forget? I know I'm talking about Final Fantasy XIV, but I don't know what the fuck Other than the writer. This? Um. Oh yeah, they revealed the whole map now. Well, not the whole map. They revealed more of the map. You know, you never know how much more they'll add later. It's just Earth. Not canonically or anything, but it's clearly just Earth. And I realized something funny. Eorzea is shaped a bit like Africa. But if you actually look at the map, it's just... And it makes sense with the, uh, the stories and the places there in the game. With the lore around it and everything. Eorzea is just Europe, an amalgamation, an amalgamation of Europe. It's just, it's just, it's one big condensed form of Europe in a weird smushed way. But it is indeed Europe. But then the new continent, and then there's, you know, Russia and uh, Asia and Japan. And Australia is Mericidia, which is not surprising because they were crazy, you know, Australians. But the new continent, the new continents... For Don Trail, it's just North America and South America, literally. Not kind of, not oh, it's it seems that no, it literally is just North and South America. So uh, that's that's pretty exciting, pretty fun. And there's hints that, you know, well, there's not hints. They showed like an advanced technology going on and stuff in one of the areas. I I'm saying. I'm agreeing with some of the rumors I've I've seen. Not rumors, uh, theories from fans. I'm joking. That may be... They're Lufinians. Which brings up two possibilities. One, they could just literally be remaking Realm Reborn pretty much, but with all Lufinians instead of Asians. Um... Well, that's the only possibility, really, with that theory. But I don't, I don't know how I feel about it. I don't know if I would hate that. Or if I would be fine with it. It's not like they're identical. But it would be a very similar story. But I don't know. I, I'm, 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 I am excited to play it. But I am not... Like, Endwalker was... That's the most, like hyped up and excited and like a a anxious to do to, to play that that had been over a game I was it was extremely excited and it paid off and Walker was amazing um, but I'm just not feeling it. this feels like stormblood to me or at the very best it feels like Roman born which I like Roman born unlike a lot of people I think Roman Reborn is actually very good. It's great at building the world, and that's fantastic. All that grinding, uh, and she's dead. Oh, and Junior's basically dead. He's going to die now. This is fantastic. I love this game. Favorite game ever. grind even more. Look at that. Dude's not even close to being done. Right. You're still gonna die anyway, Junior. He's gonna do some attack for 200 damage. Look, here he goes. Look at that. Look at that. Look at that. Look at how easy it is to tell what's gonna happen with bullshit fights in these fucking old video games. Like, what am I supposed to do? I, 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 there's no chance to survive that. There's literally 0% chance that I can win that fight. What? Oh, I wasn't supposed to push that. I'm not waiting all that time again. Just... Wait, I was supposed to push that. How do I... Oh, right, no, I just go this way. 
Let's try up here. So don't get me wrong. I am excited. I'm just not... Uh, my mind was not blown by that full trailer. In fact, the full trailer kind of didn't add anything other than... Right, so they, re they revealed the uh, new class, the second new job. Which I, at first I was like, okay, that's fine, I guess. But then they showed it, and it looks like you're playing the Squid Kid game on Switch. The, uh... Ink... Whatever, I don't remember what it's called. The squid, when you're the squid kids. Um, and you, you splash the ink around to, to win the other team. Um, squid, is there something squid in the title? Oh, my head hurts. Um, this is why I haven't been recording. I knew this would happen. My head is fucking killing me. Um, especially because of the weather. It's even worse today. And it looks like it's really unfitting and stupid looking, but more importantly, they then announce, which is what I would thought the second job should be, they then announce a Beastmaster class. And I'm like, oh yeah, and it's a limited job, it's a stupid fucking Blue Mage style non-job that you can't really play. So it was very, uh, very irritating. Kind of put me in a bad mood towards Dawn Trail even more as well. Not even more than anything else, just as well as the other things I've mentioned. Because kind of some bullshit. Like this, like this area we're in right now. You know the only way to grind in this game right now is do this, these four helicopters in a row. Um, really, dude? He never did that once to me yesterday while I was grinding. Um, that really pissed me off. Like, why would you make it such a wanted class by so many and such a popular class in other games they've been in? A bullshit non-job. Make the stupid painting girl. Well, it's not a girl necessarily, but the stupid painting class. Uh, the fucking limited job, because it's gay and retarded. It really is gay and retarded. Like, I don't even care about it. It doesn't even look fun. And I'm not... Man. I'm not looking forward to trying to play the game in a, a dungeon, let alone a fucking alliance raid with people using that shit. Remember, if you played... Uh, if you played back long enough ago... Not that too long, but... If you played when uh, they released, I guess, Endwalker... Um, so not that long ago at all... When they released the Reaper, and everybody was the Reaper, you couldn't see shit. The Reaper's animations were so insanely big and flashy and just dense, and it was non-stop. You couldn't see anything in Alliance Raids. Now it's gotten a little better because there's less of them. And because I changed the settings to not show everybody's everything, which I hated doing. But, uh, it was bad. I can't imagine how bad it's going to be with this stupid fucking looking paint splash on the screen non-stop by the, the, the eight fucking pic picto mages, pictomancers. And of course, I mean, uh, at the very least, if they keep to how they've done things, there'll be couple areas we've never seen before, not in trailers, not implied in anything either. And maybe those would be really cool. Let's go. And I, I am giving Don Shield a big big bit of leeway too though, because you can't really go from Endwalker to something else very easily at all. I always said I wanted the beach episode, and that's what they're giving us, but also even the bigger story they're gonna introduce here, I just I can't not because, oh, it's just so good. No, but the story, you can't you can't up the stakes anymore. You can't... There's nothing you could really make that would be... You, you can't spend another ten years building up a story. I mean, you can, but, like, 
that exact story was done already, and that exact story goes with the stakes as high as you can ever make them possibly in anything. So it's like, well, they did introduce. I can't. I can't. I don't want to say what it is because it is actually a big spoiler. But they've introduced. They're they're introducing in Dontrail a really cool, a new. It seems like a new diadem. I love the diadem. Um. But like, you're gonna go to like a bunch of locations, and they're all gonna be like real, like pretty and stuff. And you get to do like I don't know if it's crafting, gathering. I think it's I think it's both crafting and gathering in like the diadem. But in, in, in new places from Endwalker. Or not even from Endwalker, just new places that we haven't been to. Um, and that seems pretty cool and fun, because I, I love that kind of thing, especially if it changes over time. And they were, they were saying it does, like the more you work it. The thing is, that's just like the Diadem, where if you, if, you, if you get there late, it's already done. Not the Diadem, um, the Firmament. The Firmament is just completed already at this point. When I first started playing again, I got to see the very end, the the, the last little bit of uh, finishing the firmament on my uh, my first character that I was playing as, because that server hadn't finished it yet somehow. And I like that. I like seeing the last couple places get built. Um, but I bet this will, I think this will be be uh, that'll be fun. That'll be a fun thing. I've been I've been wanting a new DM. It is not what I expected it to be. I don't want to say that. That's also a huge spoiler. But I thought we would be... I thought there'd be, like, another... There's so many places in Final Fantasy XIV that are, like, destroyed or, like, crumbling apart. Like, like Alamigo, and I don't want to help Alamigo, but, you know, just as an example. Or, like, Doma. And where you have the Doma Restoration... The Doma Restoration Project stuff, and you donate this and that, and you rebuild the town. I thought we were going to do something like that for one of a possible couple other locations. Um, but I actually like this idea better. Um, but yeah, I'm, I'm pretty worried about Contrail. I'm hoping it's better than Stormblood, at least. I mean, it doesn't have Alamegans in it, so it'll be better. At the very least. What am I doing? I'm grinding very slowly. Nope, not worth going that way. Those monsters will take longer to kill and don't give as much experience. Monsters, enemies, whatever. I mean, we could look around, but I just I got lost. Let's see if we can find the way out. I got into the subway, and then I could not figure out how to get to the next zone. Oh, also you can go in this little building. There's nothing in there. It's just there was an item. Uh, it was like a just a, a health kit or whatever in there. That's it. But I don't want to. I don't want it to sound like I'm not excited for it. I am. I am very excited. Um, I was. That's the thing. That's the difference, though. I was rushing through on my new character. My current, you know, not new, but well, new. Not new anymore because I have var I, You know, I've already gotten through. Realm Reborn and Heaven's Word now finishing up Stormblood, very into Stormblood, like the last couple missions of Stormblood, uh, post-Stormblood, I mean, you know, like, I'm about to be in Shadowbringers again, which I love, so I'm, I was rushing it, I was like, oh, I gotta get ready, I gotta get through this, so I'm there for Dawn Trail with my new character. Not anymore, I'm gonna take my time and just re-enjoy, re-enjoy Shadowbringers, re-enjoy Endwalker, because they're both incredible. And Walker's amazing. I, I think rushing through is a disservice to it. And what's the point of playing through again if you're not going to sit there and enjoy it all properly? And so just giving through, well then I would just keep playing my other character. So I'm going to take my time and get to Dontrail when I get to Dontrail. Which should be not that long after anyway. Like a, like a couple months maybe after Dontrail's out at most. So I'll still be there you know, when it's new, just not right away. I am going to pre-order it though. I hope they don't give me an earring. I love Minfina's earring. It just looks so nice. The little, the little bright, little blue crystal earring. I wear it on like all my, all my uh, glamour plates. Okay, so I'm pretty sure we're supposed to go down this way. The other way, 
The other way had a place that looked like you were supposed to go that way, and there was even an enemy, but there was no way to keep going that way. Oh, it's this. I didn't see this. The plank. Cocksucker. I say it that way, that's a joke. I don't actually say sucker. I still remember, don't worry. I still remember to heal him. To kill him. Um. But yeah, I don't know. I don't, yeah, I don't, I don't want to sound like I'm not excited. I am very excited. I'm just also... Uh, I'm concerned. And more importantly, I'm just letting myself not run. Okay, this was not the way. Well, I got a red, to red topaz out of it. We're just going to check what it is, not necessarily use it. I don't know what Veil even does, and I still have that thing on Cosmos to turn it on permanently. Oof. Veil reduces the effect of healing ether. Like the magic. But it also negates 25% ether damage. But uh, I kind of don't like that. I don't want Cosmos taking half healing from our healing spells. An anti-veil makes the healing stronger, but it also makes you take 25% more damage from ether attacks. I get the, the theory behind those things being useful, but no thank you. Okay, so this is not the way. So I'm still stuck out here. Let's go look. Hey, buddy. Bye, buddy. Boom, 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 boom. The worst part about this place is to get out, I think, after running all the way back. There's just a chest in that blown up part of the thing, the train. Ah, I forgot about this backwards path. Hold on. Um. Yeah, I. I I got no time for wusses like you. I got no time for wusses like you. Some queer mode stealing my parking space. Um. <sighs> So I'm excited, I'm just going to take my time to get there when I get there, but that shouldn't be that long anyway, because I still have, what, like six months before the fucking Dawn Trail even comes out? Not a lot of time this video's up, of course. Um, but I'm recording this in January, like I said. There's plenty of time. Yeah, that's the path I didn't see. Oh, uh, no, that's in a different part of the... Oh, you know I love these fucking things. You're gonna see that move a lot, because I'm just spamming it every fight. Same with Junior.
If we could get the fucking robot put together more, uh, we'd be pretty okay. Do I have to go in there? Just yet? Yeah, okay. Difficult, annoying fights after difficult, annoying fights. Try to figure out the rabbit. There he is. A oh, bitch. A oh, bitch with his fireplace. Whoa. Big motherfucker, big motherfucker, big motherfucker, big motherfucker. That's my song, I hope you like it. It's just still the next buster because it's strong. Big motherfucker, big motherfucker. What do delivery people think when they hear me? Big motherfucker, big motherfucker. Uh. <laughs> I care more what the delivery people think than my stupid, shitty ass fucking cock sucking neighbors. <laughs> Toria! Eat piss! I thought about buying a new monitor. I uh, did not end up buying a new monitor. Could have, should, maybe should have, but I don't know. Didn't. Too bad, bitch. Oh, cocksucker. Whatever, I'm hiding behind them, you can't hurt me. But somehow the enemies can target people in the background. Like me. She hasn't moved, but I uh, did the wrong combo. Oh, my dick. Sure, we'll take level ups. Why not? We are out here to grind. Sort of. No, no, that's actually literally all we're out here for. Kind of forgot what you're doing. <laughs> he didn't notice me. I was just watching him.
Okay, there's those big carrots back there. How do I get to the big carrots? I don't know how to get to that piece of land up there. I don't know how to get to this piece because it's where I came from originally. When I first, you know, came to this area in the story. But I don't know how to get to the carrots. I feel like we have to get the bunny to come in. No, cocksucka. 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 Cocksucka bleat. Oh, bleat. I just got it. I am required to spend a bunch of money, so... I don't like it. I don't know, I like the game. I don't like having to spend all this money. But I like a sound investment. <sighs> oh, yeah. I don't like the house levels as much. I don't dislike them. The house levels are fine. I don't like them as much as the other levels, though. I'd rather... Uh, houses are just... Square. Here's a square. Wash off the square. It's kind of boring. Do you really think this is a good idea? It's not boring. It's still fun, but... It's like... It's just less fun than the other levels. I have more fun... Washing off, you know, motorcycle. Uh, or, like, the, the skate park and stuff like that. guesses or anything. I have no clue. It's not this way, but might as well keep going. Hey, bitch. It's gonna be so gay to get out of here. I'm just gonna do it on my own. <laughs> I'm not, I'm not recording. Walking all the way back. How to get over there? No, but found a secret. PM card D. What? Oh, okay, whatever. <laughs> Who cares? Not me. Not I. Not we. Not why. Poo poo platter in the sky. Titty caca. Cry, cry, cry. Famous poem. 
by poet, poet, by famous poet. Poetry is for homosexuals. I hate poetry. It's gay. Learn to write better. And then you got the the, the poetry that doesn't rhyme. It's not poetry anymore. It's just writing, dude. It's just it's just short fiction. It's not a poem. I don't care about all this bullshit. Either. Poem is rhyming. Eat a dick, you stupid prick. That's a poem. Oh wait, no, I'm gonna go through the shit. Cocksucker, 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 cocksucker. Look at Cosmos going running around town. Look at Cosmos, she don't make a sound. There's a fucking poem. Hey bitch, I don't know how to kill you. I don't even have to, bitch. That's right, bitch. Go <laughs> spooky somewhere else, bitch. Oh, he turned right as I'm... Mm, I decided to upgrade my computer. It's been a long, long time. I need to get a new uh, SSD. More money I don't have, but I have to spend it anyway. Required to. By the government. Not normally, but for uh, this other thing. I need one anyway, SSD. I have two very small ones. Okay. I have one that's 222 gigs. My OS is on there somehow. And one that's only 111 gigs. Both of these I got for free. No, I paid for the 222 one. It was for VR chat when I first got VR, because VR can't really can't really run VR without, uh... Um, without an SSD. There better be an exit somewhere. I already went in there. Don't make me run all the way back. I don't even remember how anymore. They're gonna make me run all the way back. <gasps> oh. Um. So I'm gonna get like a terabyte one. Cause now Final Fantasy XIV is on the 111 gig and barely, it's not gonna fit one staunch shield. That's barely on there. And then. Um, just swap that out for it. All battle systems are go. All your base are belong to us. Well, by the time this is up, they've already been fighting. 
the last part is in here, so I'm just waiting because it's gonna be the most annoying part. Gotta get doing what I've been doing. Just wait till the fucking Xenosaga Saga two. You don't if you if you skip one single fight ever, you pretty much can't like literally can't progress. It doesn't let you grind or anything, and if you missed a fight, you're not high enough level to fight a fight the boss. Whatever boss is coming up. Nobody's leveling up anytime soon. Oh, we got a lot of points. Let's let's go back to the ship. Of course, the ship. I might grind some more off camera. We'll see if I bother. Maybe not when my head's this bad, or maybe exactly you now when my head's bad. Well, we have a bunch of points. Let's use them. Items. Mm. Instant KO sometimes. Mm. I should give that to Cosmos. Revive and HP recovery. Hers doesn't matter that much because the uh, the robot stuff is uses up everything. Look at that four. Wait, why would I want... Oh, I should have max. That's a revive skill now. Yes, please. Satellite beam. Kill everything with the sat- oh, six. Oof. Never use that. It's probably good. HP divided by four. Is that what that means? Like I never use for ether stuff. Trying to save hers for if she ever gets a fucking AoE and she still isn't. Wish I had anything but spell ray there. The only one that's not near Mansion Shield sucks. Based. Based.
through some of them. Okay. I think for now, for now we're done. I might grind some more on my own so we can actually play the game again. Fuck off. <laughs>